Hello everyone, in this video I will show you how to connect your Yi Action Camera to your Windows PC to be able to control your recording as well as taking pictures. Now let's go into it right now. In order to connect the Yi Action Camera, you're going to need two things. First you want to go to Video Land Organization website and you want to download the VLC player. That's the first thing you're going to do. You're going to download and install it. And the next thing you want to do is you want to go to github.com and get the Delta Flyer Xumi Yi download. So here it is. You're going to click on this one. This is the one you need. You're going to download and install that. Once you have the VLC and once you have the Delta Flyer 4747 installed in the scripts, you have it here on your downloads. Xumi Yi Master. Okay. So we're going to click on that. Okay, but before we start, so the one that you're going to want is this CC right here. You're going to want to connect your Yi Action Camera to your Wi-Fi. Now, in order to do that, the default password in order for you to connect to your Wi-Fi is 12345678890 as your password, and you'll be able to connect the Yi Action Camera to your Wi-Fi. So... You want to, before you do that, you want to turn on your camera. So you want to turn on your camera. I'm going to demonstrate this now. Turn on your camera, and you want to have an SD card in there. It's important. you got to have an SD card in order for this to work. And you want to turn on the Wi-Fi. Make sure that it's blinking so you know that it's on. That's your Wi-Fi right there. And once it's connected, then you're going to turn on the controls. So you're going to click on the first one, the CC application. Okay, then you're going to go connect CC. All right, and here, now you have the controls. So from this point, you can do a live view, which we can, let's do a live view right now. Just to demonstrate. Alright, so from this control now, on your PC, you can see the battery life down here. You can also see how much storage you have left on your SD card. You can also zoom in and out. And if you click down here where it says single to take a photo, you can do a burst, you can do a single, you can do delay, or you can do a time lapse. Or you can control the recording. Now, on Live View, as far as I know, you can live stream. So even though you can go on live view and see yourself in real time, I really don't think you can live stream. I know that a lot of people have asked about this, but I am not sure. And here also you can see your files. So if you go into here, here you can see all your files. Now, I did a time lapse here. So that's why you have all these files in the, on the card. And you can also go under configure So under configure, you can adjust all the stuff that you can do on your phone. So you can have burst capture, how many num how many let's look in here. So how many pictures per second? And you can do a whole bunch of other things. You can also set the quality, the photo size. Let's look at the photo size. So on this camera you can go up to uh 60 megapixels. You can set the date and, date and time. You can set the seconds right here. You can set the mode. So there it is, guys. That's exactly how you would connect your Yi Action camera. So let me know if you have any more questions. If you want to learn how to do this, uh, I'll be happy to help you. Uh, but you definitely need the VLC video player. You need the Delta Flyer scripts in order to be able to do that. And uh, once again, to connect, you need to connect it to your Wi-Fi. And the uh, default password is 12345678. Now I'm going to link all this stuff on the description below. So you can go and check this stuff out for yourself. And uh, let me know if this was helpful to you. If you need any more information, uh, I'll be more than happy to help you. So... 
Thanks again for joining me, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.